hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Jess back at it with another video today we have a cooking video and we're gonna be making spaghetti I've been wanting to do this recipe for the longest so we're gonna get into it I'll be showing you guys everything that we'll be doing noting I'll be showing you guys everything that we are gonna be needing to make this recipe for this recipe all you're gonna need is one bag of spaghetti noodles and I have the skinny noodles right here I don't know why I said skinny. Thin spaghetti right here. <laughs> I also have the classico tomato and basil sauce. I've never tried this sauce before, but we're gonna try it today. I have some ground beef. I have one onion. I have total seasoning for beef, garlic salt, my dash, black pepper, and I have some pesto. Also, I have a canola oil cooking spray for my beef. Um, I got a bread for a dollar at Food for Less. And it's going to be my bread for my spaghetti. I have some garlic spread. Never tasted it, so I'm going to be a first timer. And I just wanted to show you guys for my spaghetti at the end, I'm going to be adding a little bit of Parmesan cheese. And these two types of cheese, don't know the name for these, but it tastes super, super good with the spaghetti. So we are going to be kneading one big pot like this and we're going to be adding some water inside. We are just going to add enough for the noodles to cook. So now that we filled up our pot, we are going to be adding the noodles. So we have a medium pan right here and I'll be adding my canola oil once it's heated up, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my meat. I'll probably be using half of it, not all. And that's how you know when a pan is hot. When you put the food in and you hear that sizzle, good job. You guys could um, break it down, you know, break it down in pieces. And I'll be adding my seasonings in a minute. First seasoning that I'll be adding would be the total seasoning beef. We're just going to add, a, you know, a little bit, a little bit. Some garlic salt and you guys just could put in as much as you guys think I just really eye it out ball it out como quieran decir a little bit of miss I was gonna say mr. smash but it's my smash and I'm gonna be adding black pepper and the pesto, we're going to wait a little bit to add the pesto. We are going to be cutting up this onion. We're only going to need half of it. Cutting it in little pieces. I just got done cutting the onion and my eyes are so watery like I hate it I hate it every time I make onion cut onion whatever I just freaking hate it I'm gonna be using just a bit of onion be putting it inside my meat so we're gonna be getting one tablespoon of some pesto one tablespoon and we're gonna add it we are gonna mix We're going to be setting up the timer for 30 minutes for it to simmer down. And my noodles are still not boiling, so that's good that I put my meat in already. Also, what I like to do is get a little bit of sauce from Classico, and we're going to add it in our meat. Just a little bit, just so I can get a little bit of taste. Once you have mixed the tomato sauce inside, this is how it kind of should look. Can't wait. Mm, delicious. 
so I already have my bread ready to go and as you guys could see I cut it I made some cuts on it just so I could cook better and I have my preheat oven to 300 I'm just gonna let it get heat up and we're gonna put this little baby inside for 15 minutes on 300 preheat we're gonna drain yes baby my next step is going to be adding the sauce in this pot at the kitchen. All of it. Oops. We're going to let that girl boil. We're going to maybe add a little bit of pepper over here, a little bit of pepper. Mix it a little bit. Now that my sauce is boiling, I'm going to go ahead and put my noodles inside. We're going to mix. So this is how my meat came out. And we're going to go ahead and add it on the pot. So we're going to add our meat. Now that my meat is in there, we're going to mix everything together. I told you guys that we're going to be adding some cheese. So we're going to let this sit for about five minutes and we'll come back and check on it. So this is the final outcome. Look. Bomb diggity guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys on my next one.